My name is Matthew Feinberg. I'm the product lead for KineMaster, and I'm going to be showing you our new uh, chroma key support in KineMaster 3.3, which is actually going live today in a few hours. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new project here. And I'll add a background clip in uh, to start with. I, I filmed this in Iceland last year. And uh, add a new layer on top of this. So I'm just going to pick a, a screen screen clip. And uh, I'm going to set this to fill the screen here. Go into chroma key mode and I'll turn it on. You can see there's a little bit of transparency happening in here. So what I'm going to do is uh, switch on to uh, our mask uh, mode and you can see that the mask is not uh, pure white. So I'll just bring this down. This is the foreground cut off until we see a clean mask and I can bring the background cut up, cut off uh, up a little bit. So we have a, a clean mask there as well. It's still a little bit on the edge here that I'm not happy with. So I'll go into the detail curve and this is the blending curve for the edge. If you pull down to the corner here, we just tidy that up a bit. Um, and then uh, this is not a new feature, but I'll go into color filter here and just pick a filter that's going to match the environment a bit more. And uh, just go here and uh, there we go. And that's the Chroma key feature in KineMaster 3.3.